what is going on everybody welcome back to another video I've been wanting to make this video for a while now um, I'm actually guiding at pyramid today and I've kind of wanted to just show what a day in the life of guiding out here looks like um, I'm waiting for my clients I sent him a pin and it took Troy and his buddy way farther away than it was supposed to so I think I just saw him turn down this road that we're on um, so he should be here in just a second but uh, yeah, we have really nice conditions right now. Uh, really good low pressure system. Full moon, but it's been blocked by the clouds throughout the entire night. It's supposed to be raining all day. It's 50 degrees today, where it was 30 degrees two days ago. Um, so these are these all point to good conditions. We got a slight breeze. It's not blasting. It's not light. It's kind of a good in between. So we're gonna have good chop and good cloud cover and hopefully good fishing. So um, we're gonna wait for these guys to get here and then get into it and hopefully catch some fish. So come along. All right, so gang's all here now. The route that my pin took them on was way farther away than it was supposed to be. But we're waiting right now. now. As you can hear and kind of sense, it's it's pretty windy. So we're gonna have a good time learning how to cast briefly um, with no light and lots of wind, and then we're gonna get after it. So this is Troy. What's going on? And all right. Bobby. 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 Okay, Troy and Bobby. Bad with names for the first like five minutes, and then I get them. So. So we're gonna go and try and uh, find some pigs, so come along. Yeah. All right, so both of these guys, you fly fish a little bit. A little bit. Bobby, you never really have? Never okay, not. at least not enough to tell me that he has, <laughs> which I'm thankful for because I get all these people that tell me they know how to fly fish. They come out here and they have no clue what they're doing. So that's why they hire me though. Anyways, so basically with this cast, these fish are off this shelf. This rod, compared to a normal fly rod, it's like two feet longer. We have this super heavy line here, so it's made to be able to cast in the wind, but also without having to overhand cast, so we're not casting over our heads like okay. you normally do. Yeah. This is just a big roll cast, so like normal roll cast, you know, you, I'm sure you've seen people do it, that's how they cast, right? They'll yeah. just kind of point it and shoot it. So this is essentially a glorified version of that, where we have this long rod that you use a second hand on. So when you're casting this, you're back, you want this line to anchor back there, you kind of see how it's stopping up there push and you'll push it and it'll shoot it out there and once you start getting a little bit more comfortable with that motion you'll release this line and it'll actually shoot out so like I'll be back here pause shoot it and I've cast it way out there yeah. with very little effort even in the wind like wind like this is crippling for normal fly fishing but we know this and this is this very windy place so this is kind of the thing with this wind direction that we have now as well Normally you just keep casting and standing here. What we're gonna do, I think might be the best way to, to like maximize length from our casts. First of all, you guys can see that, right? Yeah. It's just floating. That, that and then basically those flies are just sitting there. The waves are making them swim. When this thing goes under, we are bass setting this thing hard. Okay. Like that cast, like the, the, the amount of force you put on the cast forward, you're gonna like triple or quadruple that when you set. So like okay. you're way out there, yeah, yeah. this thing goes under, you are setting hard until it stops into that fish. You want okay. the rod to go whoop and stop really, into that thing's mouth. Really bend it. Okay. Yeah, and so line management is important, right? So you wanna make sure you don't have a ton of slack because if it goes, like, so say if there's all this slack, right? And say it's all just sitting right here. If I try to set this hook. You got all that line that has And I barely go. made contact still. Whereas if I do the exact same thing with no slack, Flash. flies out of the water and then you hit your other rod <laughs> so don't do that but for all intents and purposes though you're setting this yeah. freaking hard okay. until until you pop this fish in the face did you see that bobber go under i don't think he was <laughs> uh were you looking <laughs> you were it's the only only thing in the, in the water yeah it's the only thing there <laughs> <laughs> it was just gone. <laughs> I looked up and I was like, I don't see it. I don't see it. I don't see it. <laughs> that was under for a while. <laughs> make sure, make sure you're, you're pretty tight with it too. Yeah. That was cool. Damn. Set, 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 set. Hard. Strip, 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 strip. Keep it tight. Keep it tight. Yeah. There you go. There you go. Woo. Right nice, man. <laughs> That's a good fish. All right. Not, not too much. Not much more. That's a big fish. That's a big fish to start the day. All right, now keep it tight and get them on the reel. Start reeling, start reeling. And pay attention to how tight you are, because it's a good fish. Holy cow. That's a good fish, dude. 
A little bit tighter? Feel a little bit? So on that set next time, just set and stay tight. You kept lowering the rod like this. Just keep it tight the whole time. Yeah, completely barbless, so it'll come right out of their mouth. A little tighter, 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 tighter. You get that rod bent. Tighter, 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 tighter. There you go. Oh, oh dude. that's a toe, dude. No, 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 that's you. Oh my god. Yeah, dude, he's probably he's probably dude, look at that he's probably 12 or 13 pounds. Oh my gosh, dude. Oh, that is hell yeah, brother. Damn. Look at that thing. Oh, dude, that well done, crazy. brother. Dude. Well done, dude. That is amazing. Good job, man. That was the fish, man. That was That's the oh, one. That's what you drove up here for, right there. You already caught it. You caught yours. We need Troy to get one now. Oh my god. I think today's gonna be pretty good, boys. That sometimes you gotta suffer. That is that is Alright, brother. Turn him that way. And he'll, he'll he'll kick out of your hands. There he goes. Oh I'm gonna redo this whole rig real quick. Oh, set, 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 set. Dude, dude, set, set, set. Line, strip in line. Strip, strip, strip. Strip, you got a fish on. Strip, 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 strip. One sec. Oh, that was a fish, dude. 100%. Oh, no. You, you got to watch that bobber, bro. I, I just wait. No, you got to just keep going until you feel him. Here. That was a fish for sure, though. It was. 100%. Your bobber was gone, dude. It was underwater that whole time you were reeling. So instead of reeling, strip. Yeah, you strip that line in way faster. <laughs> hey, dude, that's a good sign. Yeah. And a half. Set, set, set. Strip, 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 strip. Strip, 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 strip. He's on there still. Strip, faster, faster, faster. Keep the rod tip up, 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 up. There you go. Nice, dude. <laughs> All right. <laughs> He's got the good juju, dude. That was the same fish again. While we were getting your tangle out, you know, I might sh I'm gonna shallow you up though in a second. He's smaller. Still, a, still a great trout, but nice dude. <laughs> Troy's fuming over there. Troy's fuming. You've never fly fish before. Nope. Nice dude. There's another one or what? No, it's, a, it's the same species, but this is a female versus a male. So females are chromy. It might be a male too. It's kind of hard to tell when they're at this size. Phew. Oh my God. <laughs> yeah. It's actually the biggest. Oh, set, set. There you go. Strip, 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 strip. Nice, dude. There you go, buddy. There you go. Keep it tight. Nice, man. Where'd he be on that? Oh, Told you he's going. It's, it's a good fish. Oh shit. All right, don't keep your hand off the reel now. Yep, yep, yep. You got it, dude. That's a big fish. He's, probably, he's not quite 10, but he's a good fish. Right tip up. Doesn't matter. Yes! Nice, dude. Yes! Oh, 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 oh my gosh. Hell yeah, dude. That's awesome, man. He's probably eight, eight pounds. Oh, man. Still a great fish. Oh my god. Ugh. That is. Hell yeah, brother. Dear. Now hold them lower. And then I want you to pick them up. Oh, oh. oh. oh you got you got I got I got some picture with it. Nice dude. Oh my gosh. So when you have it all the way to your left like that, okay. the closer you get it to you as far as like a center po point, okay. you can kind of control the line that it goes in. So if I want to go to the right, I'm gonna go over here. And as long as it's in front of me, I can do that. If I go, want to go in straight out, I can go here. Okay. And as long as it's still in front of me, even from here, if I want to cast over there, I'll have to go on this side of my body to do it so I don't cross over that line. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But once you're there, you're there. But so basically as it drifts way over there, just bring it over to the right like this. And that gets it closer and then come back over here and cast it the way you're going to. And then you can launch it all the way out there. Yeah. Huh. Might as well fish that. Yeah. But it's 20% it, my fish if he goes under. Because it's my cast. Yeah, I'll, I'll. Lunch break. Bobby's feeling it. Bobby's cold. He's already caught his two big fish, though. Yeah. 
So he's he's fine. He's chilling. He he can't complain. But he's just cold. Yeah. Troy still got to catch a ten pounder. Yeah. This will happen. This wind is just less than ideal. It's pretty. It's pretty. It's pushing pretty good. So we'll see. Pounder and see how. Because in that scenario too, when you do it that way, like set 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 set. That's another fish. That's a big fish. Nice. That's a big fish. Get him on the reel. You already got all that line in. Nice, man. You're good right there. You're good right there. Ooh. Nice, dude. Pretty fish. Pretty pilot. That one dunk dunk. The wave, yeah, right after passed the wave. I thought it would come back up, and yeah, it's true. I'm gonna... Oh, he's giant, dude. He's giant. Okay. He's a toad, dude. Rock tip up. Up higher, up higher. There you go. He's a toad. He's big, dude. Hand off the reel. He's big. Let him go. Let him go. Let him go. That's a big fish, dude. That's your toad. That's your toad, buddy. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, buddy. That's what, Holy smokes. That's what you're here for right there, dude. Oh, yeah. That is That's it. a toad. Look at it. That's a big female, too. She's probably 13 pounds. Oh, my gosh. Hell, yeah, dude. What a beauty. Gorgeous fish, dude. Come on. Alright. Let's go back over here. <laughs> there you go. There you go. Hold her out a little bit at me. You're with that hand. Oops. You're good. I got pictures. I got a bunch of pics. You're good. Yeah, dude. Well done. Awesome fish. Here, look. It's got some great pictures of it. Can't decide if I love Oh, set, 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 set. Nice, dude. Oh. Strip, 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 strip. Nice, brother. You were not even looking at it. I, know. <laughs> I was looking right at it. I watched it just completely done. <laughs> strip, strip, strip. Get tighter, get tighter. It's a good fish. Not as big as your big one, but it's a fish, dude. <laughs> I was like, where's this bobber? It's gone. Set, set, set. Come on, come on. <laughs> Still a good fish, dude. Pretty. Tighter, tighter, tighter. So this is a different strain. Oh, this is a different This is the other one, so you can tell it has an adipose fin. So they're like kind of interesting. They're smaller tails. Yeah. So you can still hold them the tail. Thing. We were gonna try at some point to keep a fish. Cause you do, it's a set, what, how would you describe it? Uh, so I do a type of art called gyotaku. So you kind of take a fish and after it's been uh, harvested, you can go and uh, take some traditional sumi ink or whatnot and uh, apply a printer impression on it to make a piece of art from it. Yeah, so we were gonna try and do that, but you know, we, we caught the first one, which was like, you know, you gotta put that one back. And then yeah. he caught a big one, yeah. and you gotta put that one back. And then he couldn't hold on to any fish he caught. <laughs> they kept getting away from him every time. I, I slept up. So it ended up not working out, but I'm gonna link his, uh, like it's a website, right? Or is it yeah, or Instagram. Instagram? On Instagram, it's yeah. uh, at, at Nishimoto Prince. At Nishimoto Prince. 
So that'll be down in the description. Just go check it out. Give him a follow, support him. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time. All right.